So hey everyone, this is Corbett Davis. Today we are going to take a look at a 33AA Allegro Red with a Lippert leveling system. So today we're going to take a look at running the hydraulic slides and the leveling jacks. All right, so the first thing that you wanna make sure is that the engine is running. And uh, on the red, you can see the voltage on the bottom right hand corner is at 13.5 volts. You wanna make sure that your system has at least 12 volts because if you get a low voltage situation, then it'll spike, the, your current will spike and there's a chance that you'll damage your engine, it's damage your, your pump. So that's, it's very important that the engine's running before you do any operations with your slide outs or your jacks. So the recommended sequence for the jacks and hydraulics is to level the coach first with hydraulics with your slide outs in and then run your slides out. And then whenever you finish camping, the sequence is to run your slides in first, then your jacks up and the system should, should, uh, should operate correctly. So if you get to the keypad and the, and the keypad's off, you press the power button and then auto level. You can hear that the airbags are deflating. What that does, it gets the, the coach at the lowest point so that the jacks don't have to travel as much. All right, now that the air is out of the bags, you can see that the rear is extending. All right, so it is successfully leveled. So now if you want to retract your jacks, same thing, you just, you just hold down the retract button. It starts to fill the airbags first, and then your jacks will start to retract. Okay, jacks were retracted. Now that we've covered the leveling portion, there are also some manual features. If you hit the up or down arrow, you can see you can manually uh, fill or dump your airbags, and then you can manually level left, right, up, or down. And then you can auto retract and the same thing. You can so you can press, you can hold down retract, or you can go press this arrow, go to auto retract, and then press enter. So now that the jacks are down, you can you can extend your slide outs. So you see the switch locations are strategically located so that they are close to the driver's seat. Because so what can happen if your driver's seat is reclined, uh, when you run the slides back in, you can damage your, your coach, which we don't want. So you can either leave it on the cabinet or take those out, and then it's just pretty simple, extend or retract. So there is an antenna, uh, it's got an RF dongle that this, this is ties to, which is located in the center of your coach. So if, if your switch isn't working, you may have to take it off the wall and bring it closer to the, the receiver and use it. 